hello everyone how to simplify this nice radical expression so we have a, a triple one zero and triple eight into nine and it's a whole square root so we simplify this nice algebraic expression uh, so that here the very first step we are going to do is uh, first we rewrite this expression as in this form uh, square root of you see here we have this is a triple one and again we have this is zero and triple eight and nine so we can write this expression as uh, this is zero and you have these four numbers so we we put uh, these four numbers equals to zero and here you add these numbers okay it means that when you add this number by this then you obtain here this number okay so now after that uh, you see here we again uh, we need more simplification so we write this expression as uh, triple one is multiplied by 10 raised to power 5 and here we write this expression into the scientific notation this is the ordinary notation we write this into the scientific form and plus here we again break this expression and we write it as triple eight and zero plus nine okay so after uh, this step here we uh, again uh, rewrite this expression as triple one multiplied by 10 raised to power zero plus here we write this expression as uh, uh, we write this as triple eight uh, is multiplied by 10 raised to power 1 so here we write this number into the uh, algebraic into the scientific notation form okay and after that uh, we have this is plus 9 so now after uh, this step here uh, you see here we have uh, uh, this is triple 8 and now uh, the time to break this number so we write it as a square root of uh, triple one multiplied by 10 raised to power 5 plus triple one multiplied by 8 because when you multiply triple one by 8 then you get here triple 8 and it is multiplied by 10 raised to power 1 and uh, here we have this is plus 9 so now after this step you see here we have both of these terms involved this is uh, triple one so that now we write this triple one as uh, in this form we write it as triple nine is divided by nine okay when you cancel these two terms then you get here triple one and this is multiplied by 10 raised to power five plus here we again write this triple one as uh, triple nine is divided by nine and it is multiplied by eight multiplied by a 10 raised to power one and this is plus nine and now further here uh, we write this triple nine as in this form uh, we write this as 10 raised to power 3 minus 1 because 10 raised to power 3 equals to 1000 and when we subtract 1000 by 1 then you get here triple nine and it is divided by 9 and here we multiplied by 10 raised to power 5 similarly we write this expression as 10 raised to power 3 minus 1 divided by 9 into we have this is 8 multiplied by 10 raised to power 1 and plus 9 so now here after that we need to multiply uh, these terms on these two terms and it will be written as a, a square root of when you multiply 10 raised to power 5 by 10 raised to power 3 it will be written as 10 raised to power 8 minus we multiply this term by 1 then you get 10 raised to power 5 it is divided by 9 plus here we multiply this 10 raised to power 1 on both of these terms and it will become 10 raised to power 4 minus 10 raised to power 1 divided by 9 and here we multiplied by 8 and plus we have this is 9 and after this step here uh, we need to take the LCM of this term so uh, you see here the LCM of this term is 9 and when you uh, divide this 9 by 9 then you get 1 and 1 is multiplied by above term it is written as 
10 to the power of 8 minus 10 to the power of 5 plus here this 9 is cancelled out by each other and we get 8 times of 10 to the power of 4 minus 10 to the power of 1 and here you get this is 9 times of uh, 9 and now after that here we need more simplification and we multiply this 8 on both of these terms and it will be written as 10 raised to power 8 minus 10 raised to power 5 plus here we multiply this 8 on this term and it will be written as 8 multiplied by 10 raised to power 4 minus 8 times of 10 becomes 80 and plus this is 9 times of 9 becomes here 81 and it is divided by 9 okay this is the our whole square root and now uh, after this step so now you see here we have a square root of 10 raised to power 8 minus we write this 10 raised to power 5 as 10 raised to power 4 into 10 raised to power 1 and you have plus 8 times of 8 is multiplied by 10 raised to power 4 and this is minus 80 plus 81 equals to plus 1 and it is divided by 9. And now after that here we need more simplification so now we add or subtract the like terms <clears throat> we have this is 10 raised to power 8 minus this is 10 raised to power 4 and this is again 10 raised to power 4 so this is 10 minus 10 plus 8 becomes here 10 raised to power 4 into we have this is 2 and plus 1 is divided by 9 so now after that here uh, we rewrite the above expression as this is 10 raised to power 4 we write it as 10 raised to power 4 and it's a whole square this is 10 raised to power 8 we write in this form minus this is 2 times of 10 raised to power 4 into here you multiplied by 1 and this is our plus 1 and we write this one as one square and this is divided by nine this is the our whole square root okay so now here we use the nice square identity and you know about this identity if we have a minus b whole square it is equals to a square minus two times of a b plus b square and you see here here you have our a is 10 raised to power 4 and our b is 1 so this is our 2 times of a into b so as you see here this will become the whole square of a minus b which means that our above equation is written as 10 raised to power 4 minus 1 whole square equals to 10 raised to power 4 whole square minus 2 times of 10 raised to power 4 into 1 and plus 1 square okay so now you we substitute this value is equals to this term so we substitute this value uh, inside the square root and our above expression is written as uh, 10 raised to power 4 minus 1 whole square and it is divided by 9 so when you uh, when you separate this square root then you get here this is cancelled out by this one and we know that the square root of 9 is equals to 3 and you get 10 raised to power 4 minus 1 divided by 3 okay so we write uh, this 10 raised to power 4 minus 1 is equals to 9999900 uh, uh, and it is divided by 3 so that when you subtract these two values uh, after cancellation you will get here 3 3 3 and 3 so this is the our final simplified form of the given expression and this is the final answer and thank you so much for watching this video please subscribe to my channel for more exciting videos